Hello, and welcome to CBS. We're located in scenic New York City, the greatest city in the world, because that's where CBS is. So, you've decided to join the diverse family that we call CBS. Let me be the first to welcome you to CBS, which is not only the most watched network in America, consistently bringing you the most newsworthy stories out there, but also the most diverse. But it wasn't always this way. Started from humble beginnings, CBS began its life in 1927 as a radio network under the name United Independent Broadcasting Incorporated, although this was quickly changed to a much better name, Columbia Broadcasting System, or CBS. In 1941, through the miracle of modern CBS technology and forward-looking innovation, full television convergence was achieved and the revolutionary CBS television network was founded. This unprecedented success was followed by another flash of genius. In a short 10 years, the ever-vigilant eye, the logo that America and eventually the world has come to love and trust as the number one media source, was adopted by CBS. CBS presents this program in color. Today, CBS boasts high synergy and cohesion by using the latest in content targeting such as CBS Psychographics, and operating a large number of branches under the CBS umbrella. CBS Sports, CBS Television, CBS News, CBS Films, and CBS Radio to name a few. Now I know what you're thinking. Why not CBS Showtime and CBS Simon & Schuster? <laughs> Someday. Throughout CBS's rich and colorful history, CBS has partnered with many other companies and organizations such as Sony, Warner Brothers, Fox, MGM, HBO, and Columbia Pictures to provide more innovative and fresh content. One such partnership, known as TriStar Pictures, was a venture CBS started in 1982 with HBO and Columbia Pictures. Seeing no real future in the studio, however, CBS intelligently stepped away in 1985. Sometime later, in 2007, CBS re-entered the arena of cinema with CBS Films. Now there's a studio with a name you can get behind. CBS also made its mark in home video. In 1980, MGM CBS Home Video was established, but it wasn't meant to last. After only two years of operation, CBS broke off the partnership with MGM, instead forming a new, better partnership with 20th Century Fox in 1982. Something about the way CBS Fox Video was formed just felt right, and the partnership lasted until 1998. As you might expect from a company as large, diverse, influential, progressive, respected, not to mention humble as CBS, we see our share of both good and bad publicity, and there are bound to be occasional minor oversights that are blown way out of proportion by our critics. So we used a few discredited documents here, or withheld several minutes of potentially game-changing interview dialogue there. These occurrences are insignificant in the face of such a pristine track record as that of CBS. Speaking of CBS, be sure to check out our CBS store. We have CBS water bottles, CBS mouse pads, and much, much more. And don't worry, little Tommy, we haven't forgotten your demographic. Head on over to CBS Toys for an awesome selection of kids' products. Don't you mean Gabriel Toys? <laughs> Not anymore. We renamed it. Check out CBS Toys today. CBS thanks you for joining us here at CBS today. I hope you found this brief glimpse into CBS to be an enlightening experience. To see the rest of our CBS information, please purchase CBS Tape 2.